Disclaimer. This video is for entertainment purposes only. Do not attempt this at home. Vitiated how to will not be responsible because you decided to be a cheap ass and not hire professional. On with the show. I'm back at it again. I'm sure I want to piss somebody off. I always do, especially with these posts. Well, there's an entitled clown in one of the groups I'm in that has two Argentinian dogos that they made poor decisions and they couldn't afford. So now they were trying to find homes for them, which that's, I'm okay with that. And then they were talking about just taking them and dropping them off somewhere. Being the way the shelters are now, I don't know if that would be a good thing or a bad thing. I mean, I understand it, but that's neither here nor there because you know how I feel about my animals. And then thirdly, some dumbass, stupid fuck, Sometime or another, I'm sure he's going to see this. <laughs> Mention euthanizing them. I'm like, wait a minute. You're going to take two perfectly healthy fucking dogs and euthanize them because you made poor decisions and you can't take care of them? Or you said you can't take care of them. Listening to the conversation and reading the conversation, it's just... They didn't want to find better housings for the three of them, or four of them, whatever it was. They would rather just go live where they want to live and get rid of the dogs. So, the guy said it was better for them to have them euthanized than to take them to the shelter. And I'm thinking to myself, wait a minute. If you take them to the shelter, they're going to kill them anyway. So, there's that. And then this stupid motherfucker had the audacity to ask how much euthanizing cost. Man, if I could have reached through the motherfucking phone, I swear, man, I'd have reached through that phone and it would have been legendary. <laughs> oh, call it from one of my famous movies. I can't say the beginning part, but if you've seen the movie, then you know the movie. It will be legendary, even in hell. Now, if you know the movie, then you know what I'm talking about. So for the audacity for her to even be okay with that. And then they want to call people like me a narcissistic serial killer just because we speak our mind. But we're not talking about euthanizing two perfectly okay animal or people or anything for that matter just because we don't want it. And that's the problem with your generation. I just fucking blows my mind. The audacity of the entitlement. Not just that. The motherfucking veterinarian that would do it. They would get the same treatment. I mean, you could look everywhere, all over the media, of how dogs saved kids. Dogs save their owners. And then you got clowns like that that are talking about, oh, I just want to put mine down because I can't really take care of them or I just can't do this. or Motherfucker, please. My wife will tell you. She will go before they go. It's been from day one. I've told her that's from the time we met 20 years ago. She will go before they go. She understands that. And I will not live anywhere I can't have them. Thus, reason why I'm staying in a fucking travel trailer instead of a house. Because it was more expensive to be in a damn house and all the rules and regulations than it was to be where I'm at now. So, I said, fuck you. I'm going to make it work. Yeah, it was a lot of money out of pocket at first, but hey. 
I'm not getting rid of them just because of some dumb shit like she was going to or like he's talking about doing. You got me fucked up, man. But on a side note, if there's ever an apocalypse, we're going to eat good because everything will be on the menu. <laughs>